Good morning, everyone. I hope you're having an awesome day. I'm Cassie. Welcome back to Dreamlight Valley. Where we left off, we have gotten this quest from Mirabelle to take photos with all of the capybaras. But it's going to take a few days because they aren't always all around. We've gotten classic and blue. What else is available today? Gray spotted not here today. Red and white. Brenda let me know that red and white is only available on Saturdays between a certain set of hours. And I'm overlooking one. Black and white. Okay. In the promenade all day. So at least we can get that one. And thank you to Brenda for always bringing such excellent tips. One thing I will say about all of the time I've spent playing video games online is that the coolest part is the friends I've made, um, including Brenda. I've made a lot of good friends because of this. I have a friend named Joshua who plays The Sims 2. I have a few friends who are also playing the Universe Sim. I'm playing the Universe Sim. And it has been really cool to connect with people. And oh, I don't want to forget my friend Daniel. Um, who should be studying if he's watching this right now, Daniel. But um, just an amazing group of people and I've been so lucky to to have met everyone. I said promenade and then promptly started watering, wandering around in the lagoon. So that's pretty cool. It's just me being totally with it and perfectly together. But anyway, how are you today? I hope you've had a great week. We're winding down. It's Thursday. I am not finding that capybara anywhere. The promenade is not very big. Where are you, hidden capybara? What was that a little chirp noise? Outside of, oh, wow, Mirabelle really wants my attention because I'm working on her quest. I guess I've seen that with a lot of the the Valley residents now where like they stick to you as long as you have their quest selected. And last time, last time we played on Tuesday, I was hanging out with Gaston, but Mirabelle was right there the whole time also. I'm going to give up on the hunt for the capybara for now, and we're going to pick somebody up that we can level up today. At least a little bit. All of the people that we need to level up are hanging out right here, so... I spent some time with Gaston the last time we played. I haven't spent any time with Eve lately, so I'm going to go get her. Put your pickaxe away. It's so menacing when you, like walk up to somebody with a pickaxe and say to them, do you want to hang out? Like, they're not going to tell you no. Actually, get it out for this, but then put it away. Yeah, hi. Why can't I... Got chairs in the way. It's actually kind of annoying. Like, put yourself down so I can talk to you. It does look fun, though. Okay, can I... I think it's interesting that Eve is always looking for... Like, she's basically verbal 2FA. You know what I mean? She's always asking you to confirm who you are. So what we're going to do today is mostly time bending. 
I need the mist. We have one last zone to unlock in this, uh, on this map, and we also have... We need 15,000 mist to upgrade the hourglass. Oh, I can get that swirling sand while I'm here. So we have need for mist, and mist is also needed to power the machines, to build the machines and power the machines. So. And Eve is a time bending companion. No, Mirabelle, I'm not trying to talk to you. Uh, and since Eve is a time bending companion, I don't like where this orb is placed. We'll make it happen. I get extra experience with her, and I level up her friendship faster by doing time bending while I'm hanging out with her. I know I'm explaining this to people who play the game, and you don't need this news, but just for those who haven't... Dude. This is the worst orb I've ever done. Found a piano leg. Wild. Okay, I actually think I might have some bigger chests on me. So if I have a medium chest, I do. Yay! I'm gonna put it down. And I'm gonna start. And over time, I'm going to move my time-bending stuff over from this chest to the medium chest. I'll have more space, and I uh, clearly I need the space. I can't put anything away. I'm not going to spend... Oops, there we go. I'm not going to spend a bunch of time on this today. But let's see, this was a time-bending gift. That's not. That's a lot better. Uh, I just I wanted to get the time bending gifts out of my bags. Uh, I have no n need really or intent to give them to people today, so they can hang out in my bags. This stuff actually can get put away in one of the biome chests, and my bags look much better. Wow, just immediate. And I actually don't have that much mu stuff left in this chest, so I'm gonna go ahead and move it. I still have a plan to pick up my chests and tool benches and move them all inside into like a dedicated crafting room. But at least for now, having the space to put stuff in uh, a chest at all is brilliant. Definitely needed more pieces of stone. Please tell me it's in this corner and it's not gonna... Nope, I'm gonna have to go all the way down this hallway. You may have noticed that Eve is about halfway through level 6. 
once we get her to level 7, we should, in theory, open up a quest. And then we can select that quest, and Mirabelle might leave us alone for a little bit. In this particular quest, I understand why she's tagging along with us. It is because she needs to be in the photos of the capybaras. But, you know, I think maybe it would be better if the game encouraged us to use the hangout feature to be with her for this instead of having her just perpetually there on the off chance that we stumble upon a capybara. Where are the last two? Okay, here's one. Oh, good. Sorry, Ursula, I'm not listening to you today. Just got very distracted by the fact that from a distance, a particular tree stump looked like a lizard. I'm still waking up. I definitely need many, many loots. I mean, she's being very generous today. at? Like, why am I looking over there? What's over there? Okay. Did we get every- yes, we did. I feel like I'm being very cruel to my character by making her run through sand in heels. Seems unpleasant. Hello, snakey snake. I heard it. There we go. Is there another one down here? Yes. These piano legs are coming in hard and fierce today, huh? Nope, still not listening to you today, Ursula. The snake absolutely would have bitten me by now. It put its its collar up uh, when we first approached. Which is a sign that's like, hey, please don't mess with me. And then it fled. And we still came by to mess with it. The snake absolutely would have bitten me. Oh, okay. No, E, 
safe. I also want to get this out of the way. This is where swirling sands meet. To find love, this is where they congregate. Eve, if you could level up, that would be wonderful. What do you want today? Aw, I didn't mean to give her that. It didn't hurt. The game says down. The game still says down. Oh, oh yay! I love extra course. Thank you, Eve. gonna swing back by home because I'm not carrying any food on me and I just want to quickly restore my energy and put away all the stuff I've grabbed so far. And then it'll be off to the wild tangle for, you know, more of this. Wake up, Cassie. Wake up, wake up. Classic capybara. You look cute today. Oops. No, Eve. Oops. Double ups. Not gonna lie, I lost control. That's what, what all of that was.
Sometimes my brain and hands are distinct. Mm -hmm. I saw that coming just because of where Eve was standing. I like her whirring noise. She's just doing robot things, whirring around behind us. Further up for the next one. That's the memory I can't reach. If anyone has some tips on how to, maybe if I move the plants, why can't, there we go, what happened? Here we go. I can't move the plants. So if anyone has any tips as to how to get to that memory, I would love to hear them, because that's wild. It was, I'm pretty sure one of Rapunzel's poems is one of her poems. like time bending is slow to level as a profession. We have to head up here. Hi, Jack. I hope that part of the lesson that we teach Jack Skellington through his quest line is that not everyone likes surprises. Eve. I do not like surprises. How do you feel? How do you feel about surprises? Do you like them? doing on Eve's friendship bar. Can I see it? Maybe if I give her something. Yeah, we're nearly there. I can give her some gems. Not the gems she wants, but the gems I have. trying to coax this this bar right over the edge to level 7 so that we can do a quest. Why does she have fingers? A 
if I give her that last meanest fly trap I have in my bags, how's that gonna go? Almost. It went about as well as the gems are going. There we go. Alright, we have a quest. Bring two gifts. What? Okay, of course, like, Eve wants to tell us something private, so everyone comes and stands around at that exact moment. We're gonna go to Eve's house. Okay, and we have shaken Maribel now that we've deselected her quest, so... Noted. I want that plant. I should have all of that stuff, in theory. Which plant, by the way? Which plant in the corner? Should I be seeing a dead plant? I said the plant in the corner. Yeah, I got nothing. Every, every plant in here looks fine. Uh, all right, let's go craft this thing. We need mechanical parts. Oh, I'm just gonna use the well. Oh, that's the wrong table. Mechanical parts require brass and bronze ingots, and I did not realize bronze required tin, but it does. Oh, never mind. Okay, so we crafted a few bronze ingots. We need a few brass ingots, and then those can be used to make mechanical parts. The, a combination of bronze and brass. I will probably unlock the recipe when I make the brass ingots. This is my first time making bronze and brass ingots at all. There we go. Okay, so we can make two mechanical parts. How many did we need? Just unlocking recipes left and right. I want that tub. That tub was pretty. Ancient fish vehicle. We need, okay, we need one more. So we need to do some mining. Oh my goodness, we didn't even come in here when I was time bending with Eve. Mirabelle, why are you back?
Can I not get to those because of all of the stuff in the way? Yeah, I'm gonna move this tree. Oh, hi, Minnie. Yep. I also recognize that I've cleared up some bag slots just by... Well, I've made a big mess of it, but by refining those ores, and I've needed to refine those ores for a really long time. You can probably tell this, but I have no idea where my rock spots are. I'm doing great. Oh, there's one. I'm gonna pop back over and see if I can make any more brass. Nope. Still need zinc. Okay. Where does zinc come from? Zinc comes from the wild tangle. Okay. To the wild tangle. Oh. Oops. How much energy will almonds give me? Oh, pretty good amount. Cool. I have enough. At some point, I want to, of course, have stacks of all of the ores and all of the ingots, but right now, I just want to have enough. We will make one more machine part, mechanical part, sorry. And we should have everything we need for the scanner accessory. Hi Minnie, I'm in the middle of something. What do you want? There we go. Silly. Back to Eve's house. Can you 
come in here so that I don't accidentally leave. Thank you. I'm cautiously optimistic. That's like my baseline. I'm hopeful, but wary. Eve's a good plant, Mom. I have to sneeze again. Is it going to be this kind of day where I'm continuously muting so I can sneeze? Oh wow, we really picked up our mist today too. We started the day at like 2500. Inspect. Oh, it's carnivorous. I do love carnivorous plants. Human blood. His name is Audrey Two. I already had the recipe for gourmet grubs. Someone wanted it in Remy's a while back. Oh, look at that Charlotte cake, so pretty. With the little lady fingers around the outside. Okay. The sea snails come from here, I believe. The docks. Where's your brain? Yes, sea snails come from the docks and the overlook. I'm pretty sure they just come from white ripples, but I could be wrong. And my uh, my fishing pole is enchanted, so I'm gonna get a lot of robo fish in the short term. They may also come from blue ripples like the octopi. Yeah, Eve doesn't care about my fishing. I'm fine with this. It never hurts to have more robot fish. And the enchantment will wear off on my fishing pole soon. But I think it would be nice also if there were some kind of buff bar, where I could dismiss the enchantment if I didn't want it. Yeah, no, I can't. Let's see what I pull out of here. Plastic. That's good. I'm gonna need more of that, too. Plastic is to Eternity Isle, basically what seaweed was to the valley. Nope. 
Nope. Go around. This is too much stuff. I just eat cinnamon? Yes, I can. Oh boy, it had almost no impact. That's funny. I also bet it was terrible. Can I reach that from here? Yep. Oh, I also think I have some food in my... maybe not, but... Oh yeah, I do. Cool. Gourmet grouse. Go back to Eve's house. Oh no, give them to Eve. Okay. And probably now I'll go back to Eve's house. Oh. Oh, to me. Oh, a sprout. Okay. I do want to say, Mirabelle, you are in my home. I want to take one more look for the black capybara in the promenade. I want to make sure I had the location right first. And then go and look for it. What are we? There we go. So, I want to make sure that I get that before I miss the opportunity to get it. Nope, there we go. And then we'll call it a day. A uh, pretty successful day. We leveled Eve up, we did her level 7 quest. It was very, very short. I'm calling shenanigans on the fact that the black capybara should be here all day unless it's like stuck in this cluster of stuff. Oh, that's nope, that's one whole big item and not a few small separate items. I'm just gonna like look from a distance and see if I can spot it. No. Oh, it might be up here. Are we considering this the promenade also? This game is wild. I was pretty sure this was part of the lagoon. Oh, this bamboo. It 
if you see the capybara and you're like screaming with rage that I don't also see it, I'm so sorry. I wouldn't put it past you. Like, I'd be angry at me too. back up, take one last look, and then we'll call it a day. I unfortunately don't have time for animal tracking. I have to, I have to get ready for work. Yeah, sadly I do not see it. Is there any other zone where I might find this capybara? No. Fantastic. Alright, so this is where we will leave it. Thank you for hanging out with me. I might try to log in later and see if I can find the capybara. Um, if I can, I'll let you know, but you know, you can't, you probably don't want to watch me run a, running in circles around this biome any more than I want to do it. So, thank you for hanging out with me. We managed to get Eve leveled up pretty far. We got her level 7 quest done. We now have a uh, carnivorous plant decoration for our homes. Um, I Next time we meet, we will continue on our hunt for the capybaras, and we will also level up uh, someone else. It's been a while since we've spent any time with Rapunzel. We've recently spent time with Gaston. We also may could spend some time with Jack Skellington, because I've done very little work on him as well. So thank you for hanging out with me and for being amazing, and I am so lucky to count you among my friends and to have you by my side. I hope you have an awesome day, and I'll talk to you very soon.